Okay. Yes, it is. What's up? How are you? Yeah, we're out here freezing our asses off. It's cold. The sun's going down. It was warm earlier, but it's getting chilly. Yeah. You can't swear on the telephone? Shit! Does that make you feel better? Mojave Desert phone booth. Yeah. Hi. Congratulations, you got through. Who is this? Jessica, where are you calling from? I feel like I'm answering the phones at the radio station. Wait, I'm writing your name down in the little book that we're keeping track of all the people. This is, it's a lot. Oh my, it doesn't stop ringing, so... People call all the time. Every time you put the phone down, it just rings again. So you, it's like winning the lottery to get through. Congratulations. Nope, you had to come and pick them up. I'm standing here with them. You just got to come and get them. That's, that's a problem. But if I have a piece of paper, whether it be monetary or otherwise, that I earned, why should I be able to do that? I'm learning? sure a lot of people told the government that. That same thing. It's my money. But, why but, can't I burn it? But I want to know why, though. <laughs> I mean, what's the big deal? Like burning yep, the American flag. Uh... <laughs> like burning the American flag. <laughs> that was somewhere a dollar bill. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You got the guy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> my my no, name okay. is Dan Abjean. <laughs> <laughs> I live in Santa Monica, California. I do this all the time. <laughs> Very <laughs> good. The Mojave Desert phone booth. Hey. Hey. Um, who's there? I mean, my name is Chris. Your name is Chris. My name is Chad. Hey. How, how are you, what, Chris? What brings you out there? What brings me out here? The phone yep. booth in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Why are you calling? Um, uh, I thought it was a good idea. It is a good idea. Um, I'm calling you. Actually, I'm calling you from Brussels. From Brussels? Yep. Oh, okay. How are you today? Oh, uh, well, well, way after midnight here, and it's really cold and raining. It's cold and raining? Yeah, yeah. Well, I got no a little... Good, no good time. Ah, it's Miller time, huh? No, uh, no, no. No, not lovely at all, but uh, I, I saw this thing about this phone booth, what, uh, two days ago? Yeah, where did... Paper? Two days ago you heard about the phone booth? Yeah. And where did you hear about it from? Uh, it was in a French newspaper. It was in a French newspaper? Yeah. Was it the new observatory? Yeah, exactly. Exactly, because I tell you, yesterday morning at about 7 o'clock, I took nothing but about 100 calls from France. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah. Hey, so I said, well, this doesn't exist. So yeah. I thought, uh, I oh, it does exist. No, it's no joke. This is really a phone booth standing in the middle of nowhere. No, 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 no I, I do agree with you. Uh, mm -hmm. I scanned the net, mm -hmm. and then I eventually ran across a site uh, called, uh, what is it? Uh, Mojave. Deuce of Clubs. Deuce of Clubs, yes. Yeah, right. Yes. And they're talking about this phone booth. So I said, well, this must be a joke. Yes. So I actually uh, decided to ring up. And, well, there you are, man. I mean, what brings you out there? I mean, uh, I'm... Uh, what, what brings I, me up here? Yeah, right. Well, to talk to the world. This That's phone great, rings off it? the hook 24 hours a day. This is great. Who's running this booth, Ben? It is great. My name is Chad. What is your name? Chris. Chris. Okay, Chris. Yeah. And who is running this booth? Who Bell? is running this booth? The phone company. Yeah. Which one? Bell? Pac Bell. 
I mean, they, they should have given me, they should have given letters. Well, I tell you, I, it's just, it's the craziest thing. I mean, this thing is standing up on a plateau, you know, 4,200 feet up, surrounded by Joshua trees, and there's nothing around. I see around. photos of it. I mean, there's, there's uh, pretty, like, nothing around it. Yeah? There is absolutely nothing around it but Joshua trees, yes. I just sent the heat. I mean, isn't it hot out there? Is it hot out here? Earlier today it was um, nice and mild, about 60 degrees, but right now the wind is picking up and it's cloudy. Oh, sheesh. Yeah. You wouldn't deserve that, would you? I mean, some bit of rain. I mean, is it, is it true that, that uh, there's some bullet impacts on this cabin? Or? Is it true there's what? There are some bullets 